earth. Can you feel it? The soundtrack of the earth. During this pandemic, scientists are reporting that there is a quieter level of human activity. 60% drop in human activity, in the noise, in the driving of cars, in the mindless activity of doing, 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 led by our egos and our hungers and our pains and our strivings. So much noise. We make so much noise. But can you hear it? Can you hear the vibration? Can you hear the heart of the earth? Can you hear the rhythms and the sounds of the seismic activity, the soundtrack of the tectonic plates? Can you feel it inside of yourself? Let's find that today. Earth, Earth Day, 50 years, we've been acknowledging our planet. Do we have 50 more? Can we stop listening to our noise and start listening to the heartbeat of the earth? This is Seattle drummer, Dio Jean-Baptiste. We had a lovely discussion about sound and movement in freedom and pain, from pain and freedom. Can you build a bigger room for freedom, for your pain to dance and expand and create heat and be transformed and drop your feet into the earthquake rhythms, the subtle and the cataclysmic that transform us, crack us open, create more land, push for more life, more well-being, for more song and more dance in the evolution and the ongoing movement of the earth. Jean-Baptiste Dio, I should say, accompanied a dance I made that went up on the stage in January, and you can find that work at my website. It's called Ecology of Wonder. So I invite us to lay down on the earth and to feel the vibrations coming up through our bodies. Close your eyes. Lay down on the earth. Drop into your breath. Imagine that you are a field. You are a meadow. You are a bee lawn of grasses and wild flowers. And you can feel the humming of the rhythms of the earth. Imagine this grass, these graminaceous beings rising through your body as you inhale and exhale. Tap your toes, wiggle your fingers, shimmy your hips, shimmy your head. Feel the tremors and the soundtrack of the heartbeat of the earth coming through the soil of your body as the wild grasses and the flowers rise toward the sun. Every inhale, exhale out. A little vibration, a little rising higher from the earth. Feel your knee rise. Feel your wrist rise. Bit high 
fire rising from the floor. Inhaling, exhaling, a little shimmy, a little shake, a little rise and clap. Snap. Exhale. Imagine your hips and your shoulders like big 
nest. Big nest in a tree that is your whole body. And you're shaking a big eagle from its nest. Widen your wings. Reach up high like a tall tree. Letting the shoulders and the hips and the rhythms move down and up from the shoulders and the hips up to the elbows and the knees and the wrists and the ankles and the feet. But up, up, up. Starting to play with the feet and the legs and the arms crossing back and forth, front and back, crossing your arms and legs. like a mountain, wider than your legs, wider than your hips, and feel your feet settle, find yourself grounded, feel this rhythm moving inside of you, small movement, shaking, find a tremor of an earthquake, push your feet into the ground, shake your knees and your hips and your ribs and your shoulders, Oh, out of your fingertips, reaching tall like a mountain. And ground. Feel yourself immovable in your solid, weighted sense. Take yourself into that feeling of being weight, the weight of the earth. The weight of boulders, the weight of mountains, the weight of rocks. Heavy, moving with a heaviness, moving your shoulders and your hips with a heaviness, a weighted feeling. Feeling yourself like the crust of the earth, the tectonic plates moving in your body, tectonic plates moving. Let that weighted feeling, this heavy, oh, downward heavy feeling that you are here taking up space in this world, that you deserve to be a mountain, a boulder of presence and strength and fortitude and an ability to hold space for this transition, this great earth-shattering turning that we are moving through right now. Feel yourself like the immovable mountain that never changes. No matter what the difficulty, what the storms are, the clouds, the paths, you are the earth's mountain. You feel the shifting and the changing of your body, the shoulders and the hips moving, like the heavy weight and push of the tectonic plate. Maybe taking some steps forward and back, moving in your dance of mountain and boulder, taking up weight in this world, an earthy presence, a sense of depth, an expansive reach. Feel the depth of the ancestors in the earth and the future people calling us for transformation, to care for this earth and be earth for the great turning and the love of being. <sighs>